May I help you? Hi, Cindy. My name is Barnes Simpleton. I want to speak to you about a problem with a hamster that I bought. Okay. Okay, well, I bought it from you guys like a week ago, and when I was speaking mm -hmm. to some lady or whatever about this, I said, is this going to have little hamster babies? And she's like, no, and guess what happened today? Guess what happened today? Okay, well, there's a problem. Guess because we only sell, what we only happened at this store. today? You have okay. to guess. It I had seven baby hamsters. Seven of them. And I only bought one. I don't know if this was kind of like a Christmas special. Like, you buy one, it gives birth to seven. That's that's okay, not okay. what I wanted. I need, I need you to, it's not okay, what I, I wanted. Calm down for a second. It's like, because, I'm sorry. I'm trying to stay calm. I'm just very upset. Okay, okay. you're, you're kind of yelling at me and I can't I'm get a word in that way. I apologize. I'll whisper. Okay. Wait what I'm trying to tell you is oh. I don't sell females at my store. Wait till you see I only oh. sell males. So are you but calling the right store, first of all? Okay, which store did you buy the, the buy the hamster from? This is the number on the receipt. Okay. Where do you see my O? Okay. So yeah, because uh, this is just, this is a male store, so I'm a little confused on how it could have babies. But I'm telling you, it have babies. I don't really do much, but what I do, I know what it's like when things have babies. Okay. So what, so do what I do else is with it? you guys? Because I'm just very scared. Okay, what else did your receipt say? It said how much I paid for it and how much okay. well, actually. Just so you know, my wife actually paid for it. So, you know, before she gets home, I need to stay. Okay. I just I need to make sure that they're all in there. You know, like I have, to, I have to go. I have to make sure they're all in the basket that I put them in. Okay. So, um, you know, I'm just trying to figure out how a male could have babies. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if it's a male. How do you tell? How do you tell? Um. Well, when because when they bring him. I almost stepped on one. I almost stepped on one. That would have been bad. I would have. I would have had dead hamster on my foot. I apologize. Mm -hmm. I, whew, I apologize. That was that was probably one of the scariest things that I've ever experienced. I, I, come here, little fella. How do you? I'm holding one up upside down. How do I? How do I find the penis? Well, with the newborns, you're not gonna tell. But with the with the hamsters, um, the, the one Cause that you got one, should have had it. Because I found this one. I mean, this one was like, you know, it was one inch, so I named it Baby Matt. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, no, what, what I'm saying is the one that you got from us should have had a sack on, on its back, a on what? the underside. It had like a, like a ball sack on the back? Yeah. Uh-huh. What is that? I have to Google this. What's it called? What's the... Proper terminology. Yeah, it, it's just going to be the the testicles that are on the back. Of what? Of, are we yeah. talking about the adult or the the adult babies yes. or the babies? Because I didn't see it on the adult or babies. I'm confused. Okay, so can you tell me the date on your receipt? Let me, let me look at the receipt for you. I had it before. I don't have it now. Let me go get it again. I mean, you you would think that they would make, like, hamster condoms or something, you know. <laughs> well, that's why each store only sells males or females. We don't mix them. Well, that's weird. I've, nev I've never experienced this. We were trying to get this for my daughter for Christmas, so I had to mm -hmm. build an incubator. So what I did was I took a fish tank, and I just drilled some holes in it, and I just put food in there, and I put it in my attic. So I was thinking, you know, hopefully by Christmas... It'll uh, it'll be cool for her to play with. So then mm -hmm. I came up to check on it today, and I looked, and I was like, "Oh, oh, oh, no! There's more than one. There's more than one." Okay. And it had seven babies. And again, I'm not, I'm not a baby thing. I don't deal with babies. I don't remember what it was like when I was a baby for a reason. 
So it's just like it looks like one of like you know they're missing limbs. They're all they're all random colors too. Like they're all not the same color. Like the mom, it's like okay. Uh, it's all it's all bizarre, and I don't know how to take care of them. So what do I do? Okay. So just what, what, what do I, I do I... as as a human, as a father, as 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 a person, as an American okay. citizen, as oh, somebody okay. who's scared, as as somebody who was watching TV yesterday on the couch. What do I do okay. as somebody? What? Okay. No. Okay. Picture. Okay. Picture. Picture that. Picture me. Okay. Okay. No. Could because what? No. No. Like if you if you are in my situation and you were okay. Okay. Now like if picture. Picture, pic no, just picture it would it, no, just how if no okay okay imagine if you were like this, but in my no no just in my situation. Okay, what what I'm trying okay. to do? Okay, so now that now that you did you. that, just picture it, just just me if it was just like. Picture like if 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 it was like it was like it was like a, a a real like a woman was given birth pretty much. Uh, it was okay. You know, you know when you're like that and you see the baby come out of the vag and you're like, oh 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 my god, what 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 what, what do I do? And you feel so helpless because you're not the baby or the vag, so you don't know what to do. And I I, I felt just like that. Okay. All right, so I, I understand what, now. I need the information off your So receipt. now that it was just, I had one that I barely knew how to take care of. Like on a scale of one sure. to ten, I would rate sure. myself a three. But now when I have eight of them, I would rate myself like a negative six point two. Okay, sir. What? I need the information off your receipt. I'm, I'm still. I need to look for that. I apologize that I got sidetracked. So what? What do I feed these things? Okay, the mother should be taking care of them. Okay. If it if it is indeed you know. Does it do like what humans do, like the breast milk, like exactly? Yeah. So do they I have will, to get a bottle and pump it into no. the bottle? No. No. Okay. They, they don't need they don't need your help at this point. But do I have I to like burp to them? Me. Well, do I have to like put one on my shoulder and burp it? No. Just. Just put them with the mother. Okay. Make sure the mother has food and water and leave Do them alone. Do I have to, like, taste the milk to make sure it's, like, good for these no. to drink? Sir, put yeah. them with the mother and leave them alone. All Like, all okay. of them? Do I, I have to put them in, like, or is it like a baby duck thing where the first thing they see, they know it's their mother? Um, that should already have happened. Okay. Well, then, if it happened, then they would know their mother, I believe. Mm-hmm. Oh, the mama's sleeping. The mama's sleeping. That's cute. And that's fine. That's cute. Shall I wake it up? It should be with uh, its no, babies. I need, sir, what? I need you to pay attention. I'm poking it. Sir? Yeah. Okay, I need the information off your receipt so I can look it up and verify it. Right, okay. but I'm just, I'm That's, just so overwhelmed. I'm just I, I know so that, because Christmas is almost here, and I said to myself today, "Oh God, damn! I need to get myself to Walmart, and I need to get some like I need to get stuff for my wife, for my bitchy mother-in-law. I need to get stuff for my friends, you know. And the last thing I need is baby hamsters, you know." Okay. Yep, but but here's the problem, okay? And I, I'm, I no, whole... I'm no I'm no nutritionist or I'm I'm no I'm no professional person in any way, shape, or form. I sell books to people. Okay. So, Sir? but the ma when I'm poking the mama, it's it's not moving. Okay, she's probably sleeping, but you need to listen to me. I need you to be quiet and listen to me. 
Okay. I have to. I have to be quiet. I. I oh, I apologize for talking too much. I apologize no, I mean, for upsetting you to the fact where you don't even know because it's it's so easy just sitting on the other side like oh I'm just gonna tell him to calm down. Meanwhile, I have eight hamsters in in my house. Okay. I, I, I can't even. And I can't, I can't, can't you. even. I can't help I, I need. You I need me. my mother freaking god darn Jesus inhaler. Where is it? I need to get my inhaler. God. I should I should be calm right now. Okay, uh, let me tell you the. I have a store full of people right now, and I'm happy to help you. But I need you to help. I have a house full of hamsters, so you know what I feel to, like I'm because to help you. your okay, store I'm is filled with you. people. My house is filled with hamsters. We're in the same yep, and, and boat. And I'm trying to help you, We're and you're not letting boat. me help you. I, I want you to help me so bad. I want you to want to help me at this point. I do, but I. I need you to go get your receipt and give me the information on it so that I can oh, I don't want to leave them unattended, though. Like, in my head, picture my head, then imagine inside it I know where this receipt is, but I don't want to leave them because I don't... Okay. I've never, should I take them There's with me? Should I just carry all of them? If, if they're in a box, that's great, but I can't do anything without that receipt. Well, they're on the kitchen floor. i got to have floor. that information. They're on the kitchen floor, just there. Are they in a box? They're just they, on the floor. They were before. I just put them on the floor. Okay. Should I put them in a the box? You, they just need to be with the mother. Put them in a box. Keep them contained. Well, yeah, let me, let me, let me get a box for that. I have the perfect box because I bought a new TV. Are, are you familiar with TV boxes, how big they are? Yeah. Yeah, well, I bought one, and I was going to throw it out, and you know what I said to myself? What? I said this box would be perfect for the hamster, but now there's seven baby hamsters, so I just thought, you know what I thought? You know what I thought? You thought you'd say that. No, but do you, do you know what I thought after that? What? I thought this box would be perfect for all eight hamsters! That's what I thought. Okay. I, kn I know. I know. I know. So let me go get that box. That's such a okay. great... I'm a freaking amazing genius. I am. I am so... Where's the box? Where's the box? There it is. I, I got it. I got it. There it is. I need to tell her. I need to tell her that, ma'am, guess what? You'll never guess what just happened. What's that? I found the box I was telling you about before. Okay. Woo! Yeah. They can go right in the box. Now, do I have to put them? Should I put the mother first or the babies first? Or just. It doesn't matter. They just all need to be together. All right, do yeah, I, I place I them, to... or do I just do the, you know, we just drop them? Just set them down gently. I have to answer another page. Hang on just one moment, please. I got this. Don't worry, guys. Okay, sir, are you there? No, hold, hold, hold on, hold on. Stay with me, mama. Stay with me. The mama, I think the mama's dying, ma'am. I think she's dying. I think it's gonna leave us. I, I, I don't know what to do. What do I, what do I do? Ma'am, what do I do? Ma'am, what do I do? Ma'am, 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 ma'am. I'm right here. Ma I'm right here.
What do I, what do I do? What do I, stay with me! Ah! No! Can it hear me, ma'am? It, can, it should be able can to it, hear you, but I don't know Stay with me! Ma'am, what do I do? I don't know what to tell you to do Wait, because I don't is, know what's I, going I think on. it's I think no, ma'am, no, ma'am, help, help, help. What do I? How do you do? Do had you do the CPR thing? Let me, let me, let me, let me do that. Let me do. It's not, ma'am. It's not how. It's not. It's not. I don't. I don't know if it's helping. What do I, ma'am? What do I do? What do I, I do, no, ma'am? I don't know what to tell you to do. <laughs> no! <laughs> No! Ma'am, I think it's dead. What the? Ma'am. Ma'am. I'm right here. I think it's dead. I, I don't know what, what to tell you to do. You, you're welcome to bring it back. Do you, are you, you going to, like, one. bury it or something? Um, I actually, if you're going to get another one, I have to have it back. I have seven more. Okay. Then if, if you can find your receipt, or you can give me that information, then we can take care of that I have seven baby hamsters and one dead mom in my kitchen, and all you can care about is a goddamn piece of paper. Well, I do. I have to have it. Well, I, I have, have it. it. You you don't have it. I have it. But I have a dead hamster in here. I feel like okay. I'm responsible because I was around. It's like me committing murder. That's exactly what okay. it is. And I don't want to go to jail for this. No, I, I, that will not I, happen. I need to call the police. I need, I need to call 911. Let me, I'm going to get my cell phone. You, you're going to stay here and let them know what's going on. Okay, sir, we're not going to call 911. It's dead, though. Okay, that does happen with animals. They do die. But people do die, too. Yeah, and, and we're not going to call 911 if, if you can bring those animals back with a receipt, then I can take care of you. Is is it because you guys did this on purpose? You purposely sold me stuff? Uh, no. Because I no. I believe as a person I was taught I don't I don't know my mom was is was a decent person. I I think she raised me well, and she always raised me that when things die, you have to call the police. Okay. And I yeah, feel I feel gonna... like that. It was just there, and just because, you know, I, I really believe if somebody at Petco actually helped me, it would have survived. That's my okay, belief. Okay, I don't work for Petco, Because sir. I believe that you would have been able to help me. Okay, I don't work for Petco, number one. It's pet small, whatever, whatever you guys are called. Okay. It's the same, um, it's the same animals thing. Sometimes animals do die, regardless of anything that happens. You you can't just say, you can't look at a person, right? If you see somebody die, you can't just go, oh, people die. That's not what we're talking about. Oh, so you're saying animals are not people, they don't have feelings? People are animals, not, so I'm how are animals not either. people? R riddle me that. How are we animals, but animals aren't us? How How is that any different? But, sir, I'm not going to get into this conversation Because they have you. souls, they have feelings, they obviously give birth. Mm-hmm. Yep, and, and all of that's true, and... Mm -hmm. Now, there, from what there... you've seen, it's never bit me. It's never did anything. Do you think it's going to go to heaven? I, uh, You know, I'm sure that's true. I hope so, and I, and I believe since you were around it, I'm just going to say a quick prayer, so just hold, hold on, hold on. I just need to think of the right words. I'm not. I'm not a preach. I'm not a. I'm. I'm not just to me. Dear Jesus. 
It's Bonnie again. We haven't spoke since about the last time the coffee pot broke, but don't worry. The coffee pot's fixed again. What I did was I screwed the handle back on, and now my wife doesn't get burnt when I make the coffee. So thank you for giving me the wisdom to fix the coffee pot. I'm under a bit of a different situation right now. I was getting a hamster for Susie, because probably as you know, she wanted a hamster for Christmas. And she's at that age where she's believing in Santa, but she doesn't really know if Santa's real or not. So I thought getting her a hamster would make her believe in Santa and the power of Christ. So I bought one for her and it had babies. And I know that, oh, 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 Fluffy, get away! Get away from the hamsters! Get away from the goddamn hamsters! Sorry, Jesus, that was my stupid-ass cat, but I'm, I'm right here again. So the hamster had some babies, and now the mother's dead. So I just want to say a prayer. Fluffy, you stupid piece of crap cat, I'm going to kick you in the jaw! Sorry, Jesus. That was one of your mistakes in life, was giving me Fluffy. Anyways... I don't even know. Ma'am, what was I saying before I got sidetracked? No, you were talking about the hamster having babies. Right, oh, right, right, right. So, the hamster had babies. And then the mother, the mother kind of went to a seizure nap top phase. So, I think that, uh, I should have gave it CPR. And I, sh I should have called you. I, sh I should have called you. But... I just, I just thought I was going to be able to handle it myself because I thought that you had better things to take care of, you know? Like, there's the war, there's Obama, there's a storm, there's... Who, who, who's going to know what the hell's going to happen to Miley Cyrus tomorrow? Who's, who's going to know? That girl's like six. So, I'm going to pray for her too, by the way. So God, if you can, just please bless Miley Cyrus. She's out on the road and she's going through a lot right now. So I just really hope that you can give her your wisdom and just strength to get through any situation like you did to tackle Woods. And I just, I hope, I hope you continue to bless him. I heard you get my blessing because I saw on the news that he's, he's getting himself together. So thank you, Jesus, for doing that. I, I just, I know you answer my prayers about Tiger Woods and I just hope you answer my, and you already answer my prayer about the coffee pot. You did. So... Just, just God bless my Lazarus and God, and God bless the soul and that the soul may rise like bread in a bakery and the soul may rise, it will rise to the kingdom of heaven and, and live with its mother. If its mother, if its mother died, I would like to say a prayer for that too. I would also like to bless the hamster's mother, the grandma of these babies and I hope that the mother delivers the message that she gave birth to seven of her grandchildren. And I just hope that they both can live in peace and harmony forever and ever and ever. Amen. Are you going to amen, ma'am? Amen. Thank you. You're welcome. I feel, I, I feel, I feel like it went to heaven. I think it did. You really think so, ma'am? You really think, do you, you really think I so? Do. I do. Wow. So if I think so, and you think so, then it probably yep. did. I'm sure it did. Oh, Hold, hold on. Let me go check on them. Let me let me check on them. Ma'am, ma'am, yeah. I think the I think the mom is breathing again. No, oh, that's good. I, I I think it is. How do I? Let me. Should I put it on its back? Should I put it? What should I, what should I do? I I would just leave it alone. It's a Christmas miracle. It's a miracle on Cauliflower Lane. 
That's that's who we that's what we gotta call. Miracle on Thirty Fourth Street was BS, but Miracle on Cauliflower Lane was great. So let me let me just dear dear Jesus, Bonnie again. Just want to thank you for sending that soul back down to me and making it come alive again. I want to thank you. I hope that means that you're not going to take my Lysaris with you. I, I hope that's not what you were saying. So, just just thank you, and I just I just wanted to uh, I I just I just wanted to thank you. I just wanted wanted to thank you. And I'm just gonna I'm in, in memory of you, and in honor of you, and in honor of this cat not attacking them, and in honor of the mother coming back to life. Silent night. Holy night, all is calm, all is bright. Ma'am, can you join in, please? I, uh, you know what? I'll, I'm just gonna go ahead and listen. Well, I, th I really think Jesus would appreciate if you sung with me. That's, Jesus knows what's in my heart, so I think we're okay. But I need to know what's in your voice. I, I I think you have a very good voice. Nope, you're doing just fine on your own. No, I re I really I really think after all we've been through, the least you could do is just sing a line of the song with me. I I really didn't think that I didn't think anything was that big of a deal. I just thought, hmm, may maybe she'd be able to s just one line. Round young virgin, mother and child. It's not that hard. Come on. Nope, you go ahead. Well, I, that's messed up. You're going to hell. Jesus is listening, and you're refusing to sing a song in his honor. Jesus would sing a song for you. I'm sure that's true. Right, so why wouldn't you sing a song for him? Um, because I'm not in a position where I can at this moment. Well... I really think the only position that you can't really do anything where you can't sing is if you're laying down, your head's tilted back, but that's in, like, a horrible situation, which I hope you've never been put into by anybody. But I just hope you will be able to sing that line with me. So you go right ahead. Well, I I'm going to sing regardless. I sing your grand old flag all day, every day. I just want to know if you can sing with me, and it, w it would make me feel so much better. It really would. Oh, you, you go right ahead. So you, you don't care about me, pretty much. I, I do care about you. I've been well, you no, you don't, and you don't care about me, and you don't care about Jesus. You're probably like a Muslim. Okay, now we're, we're getting into stuff that just has no bearing on this conversation. Yeah, because I just wanted you to sing with me. It's not my fault. Not my fault. I wanted you to sing. Not my fault. Would it be better if we sung one of your songs, like Dreidel, Dreidel, Dreidel? Would, would that Dad, make you want to sing? This this conversation is about to end. But I'm just I'm just upset, ma'am. So here's here's the deal. If if you need to bring the hamster back in, bring your paperwork and your receipt, and I'll be happy to take care of you. What was your name? My name is Cindy. Hello, Cindy. That's that's a that's a very nice name. Do you spell it with a E or an I? With an I. That is that's interesting. How did you how did you come up with that name? Like how did your parents get that? You know, I'm not sure. I think they just liked it. They just liked it because when when I whenever I hear Cindy, do you know what I think of? What's that? I think of Cindy from the Breda Bunch. Oh, okay. Yeah, we 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 just sing that song like it's a story of lovely lady doo, 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 who was bringing up three very lovely girls. Do you know that song? I remember All it. Yeah, them had hair of gold, like their mother. The youngest one was a skank. Pretty much. Okay. Well, you have a nice evening. 
Oh, you're leaving me now? Yeah, you just called me a skank. I think this conversation's over. No, I called the youngest person in the Brady Bunch a skank. You aren't mm -hmm. even listening. I didn't say you're a skank. I said that Cindy from the Brady Bunch was a skank. Unless you're Cindy from the Brady Bunch. So that, that, that's all right. Now, I've, I've told you what you need to do. I'm, I'm just surprised out of this entire conversation you're offended because you call I called a fictitious TV character a skank. Sir? What? This conversation is over. Well, I apologize okay. that you feel that way, skank. Okay. Now I called you yep. a skank. Yep. You have a Merry Christmas. You too. <laughs> I'm not going to tell her that I just wasted 32 minutes <laughs> of her life. <laughs>